Hey, rock stars, I'm JB, expert salesperson and master presenter. I'm the doctor, psychologist, and behavioral expert. This is the Entrepreneur Mastery Lab Podcast. We're high performance coaches that help service based professionals and entrepreneurs take their skills to the next level. 70% of entrepreneurs fail, which is why every week we have real talk with real entrepreneurs to help ensure you are not one of them. We're also the inventors of the Be Rich Mindset, where we rise to mastery, inspire greatness, celebrate knowledge, and help others along the way. So join us in the lab. And now, on to the show. What's up, everybody? I'm JB. I'm the doctor. Welcome back to the Entrepreneur Mastery Lab podcast. If you are a first-time listener, thank you so much for joining us. You are going to have your minds blown with our conversation today. And if you're joining us again, thank you, thank you, thank you. We appreciate you. We're grateful for you. And I'm certain you've already liked, followed, or subscribed, depending on what platform you're listening or watching us on. But on the off chance you haven't, just in case you haven't, make sure to give us a click, give us some love. We want to spread the word. We want to impact more people, and we could use your help. So your brain's going to explode like the 4th of July fireworks. That's it. That's it. So today I'm super excited, Doc, because not only do we have 4th of July coming up, of course, that's one of my favorite holidays of the year. Who does not love fireworks? Except maybe the kid who blew off his fingertips. Uh, one of my favorite episodes because it's a quick hit episode. So Fast and Furious, just a few tips for all of you people out there how to be more intentional at your next networking event. So a quick story as we write on topic, had a great networking event last few weeks ago now, I guess at this point, uh, where we were very intentional. Uh, the Evolve Networking, which is our awesome networking brand that we have launched down here in South Florida. So if you're in the area, check it out. We'd love to see you there. Uh, but what we were doing, we had some little action throughout the night, right? And we, we gave a little talk, we gave a little insight, a little masterclass, if you will, uh, to keep people involved and engaged and be inventive, just like we like to be. Um, and one of our topics was being intentional. And the ways that we were intentional throughout that night, before JB gives you these awesome three tips, I'll just give you a little example of how we did it that night, we paid attention to what was going on. So part of the idea is we wanted to make sure there was some good interaction. So we were intentional by watching people as they come in and what they were doing. We were also intentional with our giveaway. We had a nice little surprise giveaway uh, for one of our audience members that joined us. That no idea they were going to do it. So we had to do a little research ourselves throughout the night to find out who was going to be the, the spontaneous winner that night that fit into our need of wanting to give a specific uh, giveaway that night. So we had to be very intentional with how we started our night and who we paid attention to. And another way we were intentional, we had a little mystery gift that they carried around with them throughout the night that they weren't allowed to open, a little black envelope they weren't allowed to open until the appropriate time. And there was intention behind everything we did. It was very good for engagement. And these were just some of the ways as a host that we were able to keep you engaged. But now we want to give you three tips as someone who's there networking. Maybe you're not hosting, but you're out networking because we know you all do that as great entrepreneurs. So here's three awesome tips on how to be intentional by our one and only JB. Yeah, and that was awesome, Doc. It was an absolutely awesome event. Super excited to keep doing them. Evolved Networking, check it out on if you haven't seen this yet. If you're in Southeast Florida, you're gonna wanna check out the next one. Here's the key. Uh, if you wanna have impact at networking, you need to have intention. So we wanna pay attention to our intention. That's right, I said pay attention to our intention. You do that, you're gonna have a huge difference in your experience networking. It's all about maximizing the return on your time and energy. You wanna have a great experience, we know you do. You wouldn't be networking otherwise. Here's how you wanna go about doing it. Tip number one, be intentional with the questions you ask. That's right, be intentional with the questions that you ask. If your best question is, what do you do for work? Sorry. So boring. It's weak. It's super weak. You got to come up with something better. Guess what people love to talk about themselves. Sometimes they even love talking about their work, but the technical thing that they do so much, probably not as much. Find out what their dreams are, their values, what they care about, dig into that, find out something that's exciting them. There's a million and one questions to ask. If you need ideas, hit us up, ask us. We'll offer you great ideas. This is what we do. For people, it's what makes us so good intentional networking. 
come up with really good questions and be intentional with what you ask. That is tip number one. Tip number two, to pay attention to intention. Be intentional in how you listen. I said it, get off the phone. Don't pay attention to somebody over there. If somebody's here in front of you, listen carefully to what people are saying, to what they're really saying. Not just to what you're hearing, but to what they're saying, because there's a lot of times where what we hear and what somebody says are two different things. The easiest way to do this, repeat what they said back to them. One, they'll love you for listening. And two, if you didn't hear them correct, they'll correct you that time around, or maybe they didn't even say it correctly. And this time they'll have a chance to share what they really meant to say. So be intentional with how you listen. And the third tip to pay attention to intention and have the good impact working, get what? It's intend to give. That's right. We all go into networking hoping to receive, but if you intend to give, it will come back to you and you will make somebody else's experience memorable, exciting, and effective. And that person will want to give back to you. So multiply that with every single person you meet networking and focus on giving and you'll get back and you'll receive the greatest impact and the greatest return on your time, your energy, and your experience while you're out networking. So if you're planning on getting the most from your networking, you need to be more intentional and you need to follow those tips. Be intentional with what you ask, how you listen, and how to give. And as you see by your examples, you can be intentional as a host or as a guest. Doesn't matter what you're doing. If you put the intention behind it, you will have success. You see just by our examples. Now get out there and do it. Put it to work. Be intentional. Right. And if you're trying to be more intentional, you could use some help. Guess what? We just happen to coach professionals like yourself at being more intentional. Not sure you want to coach with us? That's okay. Check out our blog. Check out our Entrepreneur Mastery Lab private Facebook community. It's free. Check out our website. We've got a ton of resources out there to help you, including one-on-one, -on -one, two two-on-one, and group coaching. And of course, we have our free giveaway for all of you wonderful listeners, our six methods to make sure your business doesn't fail. Just click on that little button below and you can get that too. And of course, you can find us on all our social media at JB and the Doctor or at our website at jbandthedoctor.com. Yep. And with that, Doc, guess what? I've got some intention right here to get on out. So everybody Peace have out, a you. fantastic holiday. See you on the other side.